Wednesdays with me, Ivy, and thank you for joining us on the Thorn Seward Family channel. If you're new here, go ahead and smash the subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we upload a video. If you're not new, hey family, how y'all doing? Let's get into this. Every Wednesdays, I will be coming in and I will be weighing in with you, okay? This quarantine has been a doozy. I have been emotionally eating, happy eating. I guess that's emotional too, but just eating, not really doing too much. Before the quarantine started, I had stopped keto and I had started working out and going to the gym and I was able to maintain my weight loss. But then, shelter in place, COVID showed up and everything got shut down. And from there, I just been enjoying everything that has to do with everything. Now, let me give you some back history on me. Be sure to check out Sierra Creations at EtsyShop.com where you can get customized moment mugs and moment mugs designed by the Soren Seward family. We look forward to sending you your very own moment mug. And remember, all you need is a moment. I am now a stay-at-home mom. I have been a stay-at-home mom now for a year and some change. We are still new to Texas. I am a wife to Danzy. He is the love of my life. Okay, and we have five children. Destiny, she is 12. Ivy is 10. Baby Danzy, he is a fourth and he is seven. Hannah is three and Isabella is three. They're twins. Also, I am a caretaker of my mom who is dealing with kidney failure, so I help with my mom. Always keep her in prayer. Yeah, 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 yeah. And also, now that we have this quarantine, I'm a teacher. Who would have thought? Yeah, you're a teacher. But anyways, with all that being said, I still want to continue on with this weight loss journey and I want to do it with you. Hopefully, me doing it can encourage you and you can encourage me, so let's get to it. All right, you guys. Um, I did not set up for this, but I just thought, you know, maybe I should show you guys some of the things that I grabbed from the grocery store and show you some of the things that I have been eating. Something that I'm trying this week, I will let you guys know how it goes. I've never had this before, but it's supposed to be keto friendly. It only has three carbs in it, and it's jalapeno and white cheddar, which I absolutely love spicy food. So I always have Rebel ice cream and this is cookie dough ice cream um i meant to grab strawberry strawberry is my favorite flavor but um i'm still gonna enjoy this because i like their their ice cream keto friendly as well if you haven't heard of them but brie from front with the girl she put me onto this she told me that her mom was trying this type of keto ice cream as well so i picked up this one and it's called caramel butter pecans so i would definitely be letting you guys know how this goes well you might have a video um coming of me trying certain things the last time I did keto I did not do um, creamer this time I'm doing creamer and a lot of people might be against it but I am using the sugar-free um, and it's only two carbs for um, a serving so I definitely have been having this with my coffee and my body is doing different I'm trying to get it give it time to get accustomed to being back on keto so I'm being very patient frustrated but being very um just reasonable about it you know i also picked up this iceberg classic salad lettuce you know me and my daughter ivy we just eat this i gotta make sure that i'm doing better with my fats i definitely am going to make sure that i'm having more fats this week i know for sure i didn't have enough fats last week so i'm interested to see what the scale is going to look like so i got some more pecans extra sharp cheddar shredded the great value kind and then some sharp sliced cheddar strawberries I got two packs because um, it seems like whatever I run home now everybody wants to eat so got enough for everybody this is the sugar that I use on keto each time I always use this sugar and I absolutely love it it works for me keto pancakes I am going to definitely take you guys through how this is for me um, that's gonna be interesting so everything here I got from Walmart or Sam's 
if you have a question about anything in particular, just let me know down below. I love these. I know it's healthier if I just make my own avocados, which I do, which I do there over there. I did get some avocados as well. But I love these. I love these holy guacamoles. Ooh, it runs. I love it. I got some sliced mushroom. Also get my bacon from Sam's. It has three packs inside of here. My coffee. Cinnamon roll, oh, that cinnamon roll. So this is the coffee that I'll be having. And spicy ketchup. Last time when I was on keto, I did not eat any ketchup at all. Um, I am doing ketchup this time. And I absolutely love spicy ketchup. I grabbed this log here because what I've been doing, I've been making a sausage and mushroom mix. And it's totally, totally, totally so good. I think that I am going to do a video on what I use this for. Now, you guys know my go-to drinks is a must. So they just came out with this, uh, well they just came out with it in my store. This is the coconut limeade. I've never had that, but you guys know I love coconut. So I have this, and I got the one that tastes like Sprite. I got the coconut pineapple and I got grape raspberry. The other day I went and I picked up some Lily's chocolate. If you guys don't know, Lily's chocolate is really good when on keto that I know for me. So um, I have tasted all of them and I would like to say that the one that I don't like the most is the dark chocolate and I like dark chocolate. So I got dark chocolate, I got the milk chocolate, semi sweet style, and oh, I guess I got two uh, milk chocolates. So I use these and sometimes I put them in my dessert on my keto fat bombs that I make myself or I drop them inside of the ice cream. And they're really good. I'm gonna finish the dark chocolate because I paid for it, but I, I don't know. I don't, I, I'm not a huge fan for it. Definitely not a huge fan. The big bag from Sam's, it came with four in a pack. I got some rice cauliflower. I'm going to try a new recipe later on this week. If it comes out right, I'll probably make a video for that too. All right, now let's get to this um, weigh-in. All right, I hope everyone is well. Let's get going. Let's see if we're out of the 200s. Hopefully, that would be nice. That would be really, really nice. And we're not. Hmm. Well, I'm still gonna stay encouraged, still gonna keep pushing forward. Um, maybe next week, hopefully next week. We're gonna speak it. Next week we will not see 200 on the scale. Next week we will not see 200 on the scale. Okay, you guys, that was the weigh-in for this Wednesday. Thank you so much for joining me. If you have any comments and concerns, drop a comment down below and let me know how you are doing and let's get this started. Have an amazing week and I will see you soon. Stay blessed, stay true, and continue to be you because the world needs more people just like you. And if you're not feeling needed, remember here on the Soren Sievert Family channel, you are needed. Peace out.